training immersion takes place at the Govardhan Eco Village. It is in a beautiful setting surrounded by mountains, trees and forestry. The Eco Farm is 100% self-sufficient. There is water harvesting during the monsoon season. The whole, all the buildings are solar powered. They have natural um, biogases coming, they use for cooking, coming from the cow and the manure from the cow. They have a beautiful cow sanctuary, farmlands, acres of organic farming. The energy of this place is spiritually charged because there are very sattvic monks uh, who run the property. They take care of all your needs, the laundry, the food is delicious and nourishing. The monks are very pleasing in the environment and one just feels really whole and complete being here. It is a perfect place to learn, to transform, to heal, to be empowered and to dive deep into one's spiritual practices and one's spiritual journey. You know, I expected it would be the yoga experience, the immersion, just yoga virtually 24-7. But in addition to that, it was the Indian experience. I think what I appreciate from some of my teachers in the States is when they can talk to me about Indian culture and tradition. I don't think you get from a book what you get from experience. Uh, for me, it's really important to have a spiritual part that is mixed with um, more physical training because yoga is not only about training your body, it's not about only doing a workout. And the Eco Village is great, we have a nice uh, place to practice, nice uh, house, nice laundry, nice uh, um, food. It was good because I think for uh, 15 days hard training like this you don't have to to worry about other things than train and learn so it's really important that the other conditions are good and here it was actually yeah pretty great. Something mystical happens when you take yourself out of your environment and dive into yoga in the land where yoga came from where the mystics are deep in meditation. This training is very unique. You will learn the intricate art of yoga sequencing, adaption for therapeutic needs, pranayama and its healing effects, yoga for depression and anxiety, anatomy, Ayurveda and yoga and mama point therapy. The whole training will be layered and intertwined with rich bhakti yoga philosophy daily mantra and Sanskrit practice. It is important for me to continue to keep the ancient tradition and teachings of yoga alive and make a 5,000 year old tradition accessible to the 21st century yogi. Hey Krishna.